This is Culture Communication and Brand Moments with Shelby Joe Long, the show that takes you around the world to share interviews with some of the most successful and relevant people on the planet, hear their stories, and get the most important business lessons they have learned on their road to success, and get exclusive advice on how to implement their success into your life and business. Culture Communication and Brand Moments is brought to you by the Strategic Advisor Board and your host, Shelby Joe Long. Hi, everyone. Shelby Jo Long with Business Dynamics and the Strategic Advisor Board on the Genius Entrepreneur Podcast. And today I have the opportunity to talk with three individuals that are hosting this amazing retreat that I kind of feel like I need to go to. Being an executive woman and wanting to write another book, we have these three experts in the room that are going to talk to us about their treat, retreat called Let's Get It Done. It's a private writing retreat for executive women that just need that extra weekend to sit down with experts and get their manuscript put together and get their book out there. I'm excited today to talk to, to learn more about this event. I've worked with Susie, Nadia, and Tiffany in the past, and I'm excited to learn more about them. But before we start talking about the event, let's learn about who we're talking to. So Tiffany, if you want to start and introduce yourself and your business, and then we'll get through the rest of the introductions. Okay. Hello, everyone out there in the world. I am Tiffany Bakillian, CEO and founder of Speak Fire Publishing, where I take fearful writers all the way through the wonderful winding road to polish published authors who are confident about telling their stories, sharing their books, and creating their community. And I am on fire for this event. So I can't wait to talk to you more about it. That's awesome. Tiffany, I'm excited to learn more about your business too. And uh, we have so many publishers in the room. Nadia is our other publisher that is here today to help tell us about this event. Nadia, go ahead and introduce yourself. Hello, everybody. My name is Nadia. I'm the CEO and owner of Peak Publishing. We work with both corporate clients and self-published authors, and we do that full scope publishing process. We work from the very beginning in developmental editing, getting your content in order, all the way down to distributing your book and actually publishing it and getting it out there into the world. So there's editing, design, everything. It's a lot of fun. And I'm also on fire for this retreat, just like Tiffany is. It's going to be really exciting and it's going to be a great time. That's awesome. Thanks, Nadia. Finally, to introduce Susie, Susie is my publisher that helped me just publish my book small, uh, small plug for my book, but my book just came out last month and Susie helped walk me through the process. So I can't think of a better person to run this retreat than her since she's already helped me do this. So Susie, go ahead and introduce yourself. Thanks, Shelby. I'm Susie Schaefer, founder of Finish the Book Publishing, and I help authors take their book from start to finish, um, including a bestseller campaign. Um, one of the things that is a hallmark of my brand is the um, how to get authors to use cause publishing, which is um, having a social impact with your book and how to do that. So, um, and I should also note that all of us on your screen right now, Shelby, Tiffany, Nadia, and myself are all part of Rogue Publishing Partners. So a little plug to Rogue uh, because we all come together to support each other and offer our services um, for all kinds of different things, including the Let's Get It Done retreat. Absolutely. Yeah, the row community is so amazing and so diverse, and there's so much opportunity in there that helps independent authors get their voice out into the world, develop that stamp of credibility in their business, and also get it done. So I'm excited to hear more about this. Um, Tiffany, if you would just want to give us a brief overview about this retreat, since it's coming up in the next couple of months, give our audience an idea of what this retreat is and how kind of curious how, how this all came about. So can you give us the 30,000 foot view of all of this event that's going to happen? Well, it actually started as a dream Nadia had. And she woke up and said, I had the strangest dream that you and I were doing this, this retreat. I said, well, let's, let's get it done. That's the short story of how it started. And we laughed and then we, yeah. Let's get it done. I'm meeting with this woman, Susie, and she's really great, and she might have a venue. I'll get back to you later. So then she met with Susie, and Susie was like, I want to be part of this. 
And then we started talking about, well, who's our target? Women, and not just women, women who are in powerful positions, but do not or might not understand just how powerful their voice is and how much more credibility their voice will have in their particular fields with a published book, especially with a bestseller. You are not the only bestseller in this in this chat, my friend Shelby Go. I also my book that just came out last month is also a bestseller, and I am on fire to help as many. Uh, not just me, all of us. Every single time we start talking about it, we get giddy, we start to giggle, we start telling stories about how we're women in the marketplace, powerful, intelligent, still sassy, still sexy, and still story strong. So we can stand on our platforms and speak to the world in our fields of excellence. And we, we're talking to um, tea shop owners. We're talking to medical technicians, STEM, uh, industry, um, sorry, entertainment industry. And we want to bring these wonderful people together, give them an opportunity to network with one another, you know, flip their own gifts into these different paradigms, give them a space to write their own stories. And also help them to craft those stories so they don't get analysis paralysis, um, imitations, um, what is it, imposter syndrome. They just get they get it as excited as I am to where the words are just like, oh my gosh, it's, it's just coming so fast. I'm so excited. I want to get it done. And we say, okay, let's get it done. And quite often, those people that are sitting in those leadership roles that have 15 million other things going on. Just need to set aside some time and do that. I'll give you an example of the small writing retreat that I did with Susie and my editor, Bonnie, uh, just a, not too long ago. It feels like not too long ago, but that was really, I met with them. We had a weekend together. We talked about the book. We actually figured out what the book would be called. And there was the, all these different ways of configuring things and what am I going to talk about? And then that really inspired me to get into the writing process. So I, I can... A I, again, coming to something like this, where there's three of you in the same room together, all there to help get things done, I think is just such an amazing thing. The other thing that I think is really cool about it is that it becomes this business, this kind of elite business networking event and where all of these businesses can be drawn together. I love stuff like that. That's what I love doing in my business is helping books become bigger businesses and it's just so fun to think about how all of the what what those connections and what that can transpire over that weekend. That's that could be millions of dollars that are in a product to that weekend. That's a really great overview. So Nadia, can you tell us a little bit about what we can do? What what to expect for the weekend and what results we can expect from that yeah, weekend. Yeah, absolutely. And, you know, I love, Shelby, that you said the whole concept of being in person with the writer. When you're side by side with your editor, I mean, that takes it to the whole, a whole like next level, elite level. You are really going to drill down, down into the weeds of content to really figure out, okay, what is that hook? How are you going to get your readers to dive in and engage with your content? What can you do visually to make it look cool? And then to just take it a step back really quick about the fact that we're focused on women. The reason is that I feel, in my own opinion, women, especially CEOs, especially leaders, they have a very holistic approach to leadership. They have this ability to look at everything full scope, full spectrum on how to solve problems, how to lead with that problem solving mentality. I mean, it's a, a, a maternal instinct sometimes with moms who have kids, they know how to just like, okay, let's think 10, 10 steps ahead. Let's, let's do near future, distant future decision-making. So that's a lot of, you know, the background on why we want to really work with women CEOs. And then the other reason for that, and then I'll get to answering your question too. But the other thing is that, you know, women who are in leadership positions tend to sit on the sidelines. They tend to just kind of sit back a little bit and, and not really look at themselves as experts in their industries. And they are experts in their industries. They've got to get their message out there to share with other women to inspire them. And so that's a lot of where, you know, when Tiffany and I talked about why we wanted to do a retreat in the first place, and then Susie kind of jumped on and said, you know what, this is exactly what we need to do and focus it on women. And where would we have it? It would be, you know, in a 
really, really cool setting to, that would, you know, ignite that inspiration. So that was a little bit of, you know, the, the beginning stages of where we were really wanting to go with this. Um, but what we will do that weekend and what we expect the walkaways or the key takeaways when you walk away from the retreat is that that writing process doesn't end. It doesn't just begin or end in a writer's retreat. It has to keep going. You cannot lose that momentum. You got to keep that fire burning with that writing process. And this writing retreat isn't just, oh, a nice vacation and a nice setting, you know, to do some writing. It is some of that. You will be able, you know, the attendees will be able to do that writing, but they're going to walk away with a plan, a game plan. What's next? How do I keep going? What what is that structure? You know what that full scope on how to um, get that content in order for a book, a really substantial book, uh, will be figured out on that weekend. So it's going to be a really really cool weekend. Having that side by side with your editor in person is rare, and that's something that's kind of a big deal with this weekend. So I'm beyond excited about that. I think there's been, I feel, I feel it with our audience that there's a need to want to be together and to want to have that, the, the conversations that happen face to face are so much different than on Zoom, even though Zoom allows us to meet all over the country, but it makes such a difference. And I think there's just, there's nothing but benefit that could happen from that weekend. So, um, gosh, I think I'm going to have to sign up. Sounds no, good to you me. You better come, Shelby. <laughs> <laughs> but the the other exciting thing is that it's in California in Temecula wine country. And I think that sounds pretty good too. So it's not only a destination, but it is a destination with all of these amazing experts drawn together. So Susie, can you, can you give us a little bit more information about the weekend and what we can see from it? Yeah, absolutely. Um, both Tiffany and Nadia raised some really great points about us coming together in person, having time to write, but also getting guidance and, and being able to structure. Literally, if you come to this retreat, you're going to walk away with your outline ready to go. So, And you're going to have a lot of tools and things that are going to help you when you go out and, and complete the writing and understand what next steps are. So you're definitely going to get all of that. But the other thing is that it's about the environment that we're going to be in. So we have a special location. It's called Chateau Blanc Vineyard Estate. It is in Temecula, California, about an hour northeast of uh, San Diego. And it is a beautiful property that has a French inspired style uh, house with a pool, hot tub, um, and it has overlooks its own vineyard. So it's absolutely gorgeous. Um, we also have the ability to cook all kinds of meals for you because Amy Chivica is our private chef and she comes to the table and makes the most amazing, um, she, she was Italian trained, like Italian chef trained, which is amazing. But then she comes and she cooks us these these fantastic meals that are healthy and nutritious. And, and so it just kind of brings everything together. So we're spending time together, but we're eating healthy. Um, we're, we're just really kind of in, engaging ourselves in the, all, the process, just a real immersion. But in addition, so Friday night, we're going to arrive, have a really nice meal together. Um, and then Saturday, we're going to do, we're going to start diving into all the lessons um, and then kind of just, take it like as it goes for that, that day to kind of give people time to write um, as well as have some in instruction. We also on Sunday, um, after we do a, kind of a wrap up of some of the lessons that we're learning and some of the, the tips that we're learning, um, we're actually going to go do a wine tasting and that's included in the price of, the, of this retreat, which is amazing. So uh, I'm picking one of my favorite wineries to take you all to, and uh, we're going to do a little wine tour. Um, and then of course we have our last night there, our wrap up dinner. And then of course, Monday we'll all depart for, for home. But the other thing too, is that we've designed this specifically so that we have three VIP packages. So you want to go to the website, which is let's get it done dot today. Let's get it done dot today. Check out the packages because they are amazing. So we have three different uh, VIP packages that include all of your lodging, all of your meals and one-on-one uh, -on -one sessions with us. Um, it's just phenomenal. But then for people that are in the local area or 
for people that might actually have, say, hotel points or they want to book their own reservation for accommodations, we have a two-day weekend package, which is just Saturday and Sunday. So you get all of the classes and the tutorials and the writing time and spending time with us on the property and your meals. It includes the meals for both Saturday and Sunday and includes the wine tasting. Um, so we have the VIP packages are priced accordingly to, to those types of accommodations. And then the two-day weekend package is only $750, includes your wine tasting, includes all of the instruction, and includes all your meals for Saturday and Sunday. So go to letsgetitdone.today, check out all the options. Um, I think that as we approach the holidays, we're going to start filling up pretty fast. And if you know somebody who wants an awesome Christmas gift, this is the perfect gift to give somebody because um, I, I can... I can hear a lot of husbands thinking, oh my God, my wife needs to go on this trip. She needs a weekend away to write her book and she's not going to do it unless I kick her in the pants. So <laughs> here you go. This is your perfect opportunity to buy someone um, an awesome retreat, uh, writing experience and, uh, and sh come share it with us in Temecula. I can vouch for the states that you stay at and the wine tour that you go on. It's all amazing. So it's been incredible. Can somebody talk about the, you know, of course it's women that want to write a book. What type of book? Uh, I mean, this isn't a fiction, fiction, nonfiction. Tell me what kind of audience you're directing this towards so we can be more directed with the marketing of it. I would like to say, you you never know how your story is going to come out. My particular bestseller is a memoir, but it's also a poetry book. It really depends on how you work, how you communicate, and what your story is. And that's why it's so important that you get away from all the distractions so that you can build that outline that will really focus you to, at this point, I think we're working more on the content that is specific to your industry. But that is so why, because if your, if your personal story is how you got into what you do, and it, your personal story is at level one, and your industry and professional success is at level 22, it could be a course, it could, the options are endless. And we want to see women thriving with their voices completely unlocked, free and loud, so that they can do whatever best serves their particular target. And we're going to talk about how to help them find their community, their target at the retreat. And you say you're not in marketing, Tiffany. That's <laughs> like the key thing for marketing. That's awesome. It's, uh, yeah, it it's, sounds like a you can tell your story, you can write your memoir and also have that be the backbone in what I do. That's the backbone of your brand and your, your client, your own personal journey is your why and why people are connected with you and your entrepreneurship journey is the inspiration for people. So that's, that, that was one of the biggest challenges in my book and what helped me out in the retreat is how do I how do I tell this crazy story and how do I mix it with my entrepreneurship journey? And then how do we make sure that that's the core values of my brand, all of that tied together during that weekend. And I felt a lot better about that. So it's, yeah. it's good to be able to draw all that together. Shelby, one of the things that we're actually going to work with all of the authors on is their own trifecta. And so this is your story, your brand and your community how to bring all those three things together, and then identify your cause for social impact. So that is one of the, the things that we're actually going to cover. Like it, it is an actual workshop within this weekend. So if somebody's saying, how do I connect this? I don't know how that all works. You need to be there because you're going to learn exactly how to do that. It's what people need. People are looking for that impact, looking for that purpose, looking where to put their ideas. It's uh, That sounds like a very empowering weekend. So what else can we talk about this week? Any other important things that our audience should know about? And how can they contact you if they have any questions, the three of you? And we'll include all your contact information in the publication and all that, but just let our audience know about your websites and all that. If you want to get more questions about Let's Get It Done, obviously go to the website, www.letsgetitdone.today. If you want to talk to me specifically, 
it's easy. www.bookwithtiffany.com and we will talk it up and we will get you ready for the retreat or we will get you ready for the VIP in the retreat. How about that? <laughs> Sounds great. Sounds great. Nadia, what about you? So you can contact me on my website, peakpublishing.com. I have a contact form that will go straight to my email, or you can just email me directly. That works too. My email is nadia at peakpublishing.com. And I just want to encourage everybody to ask questions, ask a ton of questions. We are, all three of us are happy to answer anything, um, any sort of hesitation that you might have if you've never been on a writer's retreat before, what that's like, all of those things, whatever you want to ask, ask us, please don't hesitate to do that. Great. And Susie. So yeah, you can go to my website, which is finishthebookpublishing.com. I also have a click, a little button where you can click and link to consultation, which is free. And um, it's 30 minutes of, of my time to answer any questions you might have. And if it's specifically about the retreat, I'll contact both Nadia and Tiffany and see if they want to hop on the call to make sure we answer all your questions. You can also email me, Susie at finishthebookpublishing.com. Um, but yeah, like Nadia said, ask questions. Uh, we're here to help you guys out and to share our expertise and make sure that you're putting out the best book possible. Thank you, ladies. This is such a treat. It sounds like such a wonderful weekend and one that is not only enjoyable, but one that's going to be very productive. My only complaint is it sounds like I'd have a lot of work to do after the weekend's done, but then you'd have the accountability structure there and the people to help push you through that. And that is key for getting your book done. Uh, all published authors and Anybody that's thinking about publishing a book that's in the back of your mind, that's what you need. And it is a lot of work, but there is a smart way to go about that. And I can't imagine a better place to discover that than with three expert publishers in their retreat in January. Ladies, thank you for joining me on the podcast today. What a treat to be able to tell everybody about this. Very excited to have this interview. And I look forward to the post interview and talking to some people that went through this retreat. I see this as something that's going to happen over and over again. Doesn't this sound good? Like a good idea? See, here's my, my business, uh, the, making a big business out of it. I just think it's going to be great. Um, thank you all again for joining me today. And listeners, if you have any questions about publishing, you have three experts here in the room to be able to answer your questions. I'll see you next time. Thanks for listening to Culture, Communication, and Brand Moments with your host, Shelby Jo Long. Please leave your feedback and visit strategicadvisorboard.com to get the latest and greatest business advisement on the planet. Follow us on social media for updates, and we will see you on the next episode.